Bifurcation. Bifurcation is really a fancy word for two forks. It is the situation where patent infringement actions and revocation actions are heard separately by different judges at different times. Typically, the infringement action is decided more quickly than the revocation action. That is currently the standard in national patent litigation in Germany. And an injunction can then sometimes be granted on a patent that is later found to be invalid. The UPC has opted for a non-bifurcated approach, where infringement and validity are dealt with together. However, there are a couple of scenarios where bifurcation might occur by way of exception. The first scenario is where the patent proprietor files an infringement action first before a local division, and then the potential infringer challenges the validity of this patent by way of counterclaim. The local division must then choose one of three courses of action. The first option is for the local division to take on both the infringement action and the counterclaim for revocation, and then there is no bifurcation. The second option is for the local division to refer the entire case to the central division, but this can only happen with the agreement of the parties. Again, there is no bifurcation. In the third option, the local division can refer the counterclaim for revocation to the central division and keep the infringement action in the local division, and that is a bifurcation scenario. The second scenario is where a potential infringer files a revocation action first before the central division, and then the patentee files a separate infringement action before a local division. The local division can then keep the infringement action and let the standalone revocation action continue before the central division. Again, that is a bifurcated option. Alternatively, the local division can refer the infringement action to the central division with the agreement of both parties, and that is again a no uh, bifurcation option. Now, what are the consequences of bifurcation? The UPC package put rules in place to avoid the injunction gap I mentioned earlier. In the event of bifurcation, the revocation action before the central division is accelerated. At the same time, the local division can stay the infringement action to await the central division's decision on the validity of the patent, and they even must stay the infringement action if there is a high likelihood that the patent would be declared invalid later. Now, how the parties will use these bifurcation options will largely depend on the perceived strength of the patent. For stronger patents, bifurcation is a good option for the patentee. For weaker patents, bifurcation is usually in the advantage of the potential infringer, because there's a good chance that the infringement action will be stayed while the revocation action or counterclaim is still pending.